Okay, God bless you in Jesus' name. What I'm actually trying to tell everyone is we're getting raptured on Christmas. I, um, December the 25th, 2018 is the rapture. What I'm trying to say is that the, the little girl got uh, got a dream or something. from the. They told him the time is out. The angels. Starting tomorrow, the 18th, because it said next Tuesday, the 18th starts our eight-day window. A man child is unclean. For seven days on the eighth day, it's circumcised. We have to wait eight days. Eight days. Starting tomorrow, it's going to be eight days. So tomorrow's the 18th. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. That's seven days. Then the eighth day is Christmas the 25th. So we've got to wait eight days. So by no means, I didn't say the rapture is the 17th or the 18th. It's Christmas. I've been saying December the 25th, 2018. Well, basically, everything is set to go. We are leaving. I've told everybody the sword is coming. You all know the sword is coming to the ones that are scoffing and mocking and laughing their heads off. Keep laughing your heads off. You're fulfilling Bible prophecy. This said they would be mocking and scoffing. Well, a man child is unclean for seven days. On the eighth day, it's circumcised. We're getting circumcised on Christmas. We're going to be born on Christmas. And into our incorruptible bodies, we'll be standing in the throne room with Jesus, with our God, face to face. And we'll be fully known. And after we get raptured, the devil and his demons, their time is very, very short because... Um, Jacob's trouble will begin and God's wrath will begin. And fire will start raining down from heaven. It's going to be really, the earth, it's called Jacob's trouble. It's going to be bad. We're not appointed to wrath. The Gentiles are going to go first and the Jews are going to go last because it says the Jews were first, the Gentiles were last so in the end. The Gentiles will be first and the Jews will be last. It says he was first First is first, and then last is last. And the end, last will be first, and first will be last. So, everything is happening. We're going home. I'm just so glad in Jesus' name God has woken up God's children, and they realize it's time to go home. It's, it's, it's time to be raptured. And it is biblical. The word rapture is not in the Bible. But snatching away, you know, and Revelation 12 did happen. I believe with all my might. Of course, if you don't believe in Revelation 12, you're not going to understand this. But it happened. Revelation 12 happened. There's no going back. And I wouldn't want to go back. I'm glad Jesus is coming. world's getting evil and wicked. People are mean. People are mean to me every day. Constantly. I mean, these a lot of these people are controlled by the devil and the demons. And... It's getting evil. But guess what? Jesus is coming now and it's over. There's no more time. So accept Jesus into your heart as your personal Savior. Because there's a way out. Yes, the rapture is an escape. We are going to escape the earth. It says in the Bible, um, since you've kept since you've kept something like patience. Um, no, it's just something like since you've... Um, Kept my commandment, I will keep you from the hour of trial. It's going to come on the whole earth. Yes, it is an escape. The rapture is an escape. We are going to escape. And there's nothing wrong with that. We're going to be with Jesus. And then we're going to come back with Jesus, with his army, I think on horses. And we're going to defeat, Jesus will defeat the Antichrist. And we'll be by his side. But, Time is out. Accept Jesus into your heart as your personal Savior. He will save you. It says in the, in the Scriptures, when you've seen Jesus, you've seen the Father. Holy Spirit dwells in us. The, Jesus, the Father, and the Holy Spirit, one trying God. There's only one God. His name is Jesus. He died for our sins. He's redeemed us. He chose us for creation. He knew us in Him before He made us. And guess what? The, he's coming right now. The King is on His way been a long time we've waited for our king to return. But the king of kings and the Lord of lords, which is Jesus, Jesus is the king, he's coming. So, 
Revelation 12 is about to be complete. Jacob's trouble is about to start. The man-child is about to be caught up into God's throne, into Jesus' throne. And there's only going to be seven years left. Well, I bind up the demons in Jesus' name. Whatever they try to do will bounce in the um, demon's face. Whatever the evil people, children of darkness, try to do will bounce in their face in Jesus' name. Protect all of God's children. Protect all the Gentiles of the world that belong to you, Jesus, that are are chosen. Protect the, the um, children of light. Protect all the, the Jews, the 144,000 Jews, Jacob's trouble. In Jesus' name, let your kingdom come, let your will be done. Well, we have eight days to go starting tomorrow. And on the eighth day, we're circumcised, which is Christmas. Well, God bless y'all. Talk to you later. Bye.